Everyone, I want to introduce Mary from Mari. She's all the way from, uh, is it New Zealand or Australia? New Zealand. She was down with them yesterday and she's here with us today. So please welcome Mary from Mari. I have come to honor you. I have come to honor each and every one of you. I am very Apuni, which is irrelevant. I have come with my ancestors today. We are of the tribe of Tiarwa of the Great Lakes, of Maori. The first to have set down the nuclear free country, we do that. will be the epitome, you will be the pioneers that will deliver your people out of this mess. I come humble. I come to honor the great sports of Haitiaki, the guardians of the land. I come not with the great academic lines. I can only come with the surety that we are with you in every way, brothers and sisters here today. We have had our march yesterday and we were triumphant. We were triumphant. And so if I'm Maui, Aotearoa, as you know, New Zealand, because that's what they like to call us. But we are the Maori people, we're simple people. We are the people of the land. I come to you to honor you, to give you my spirit, the spirit of my Tupuma. For we are great warriors. Great warriors. We have taken lives with our hands. Now we bring the white feather of the Huya, the peace march. And you will overcome the academic world because it is in your soul. In your spirit, it is what you do here today. Continue your courage. Be strong. We cannot come to your land and walk your war with you. I have come today to let you know they won't get on our shores. I give the apologies of my elders, they are far too old, they are too precious, they cannot travel today. But they send in one one because we have the blood and the oom, the fire that burns. And so when you go away from here today, don't stop what you do. Educate your babies in your night hour. Teach your children that the unification and the peace of the world comes together with kai, with food. That is one thing we all have in common. Is the food, is the kai. My ancestors, unrelated, I can go back 88 generations to our seed that was first given to us by Great Spirit Yatua. And it's a precious gift. You hold on to that time. Because each and every one of you has come from a great line of great truths. That's why you are here today. Not to make noise, to stand up and be seen and be heard. But you are the warriors of the peace march. You are the answer for our children tomorrow. I come humble to your land. I honor each and every one of you here today. And as I come with my heart on my sleeve, 
I can only tell you the stories of my elders. And that is we continue today to harvest, to plant by Rona, the moon, and all those things that were entrenched to us by great spirit. For I am medicine woman, generational, as each and every one of you are. You are also one year. You have a responsibility. Your children as they are born into this world, they hear the whispers of your voice. Make sure it's gentle. Make sure it's laden with the other hand and love. Because that is what wins wars. Well, I can guarantee to you, my brothers in Maori, that we have a mighty kaikia. Our prayers are mighty. That is how we are warriors of today. We hold you close in our arms and our hearts. When we march, we march. When you stand, we stand. When you hit, we hurt. Oh, great warriors, we stand here today. Our own. another generation will go down, but you will come up. Another generation will come up. So this is a season for all of us, as my forefather, and his forefather, and his forefather, and all the mighty queer, the elder women, the mana of the women of our tribes, how humble and honoring the Tani, the me, we work in unison, so, together, projecto, and it's in that unison as Wahine and Tani, the bringing of the two of Papa, Rangi Anui, Papa Tuinoko, Hey Mama, and Mother, bring the duality together and everything that you do. Because we can't have one without the other. So God your waters, God your land, God your power. The wonderful, the wonderful way you are the spirit today is when you're going to have to bleed like yesterday. Because we infiltrate the universities. We infiltrate the institutes as they have infiltrated our tribes. And you must fight today with the soul and the spirit of knowing that you move your mind and listen that you with your heart. It's going to be your ticket to freedom. So it's a great honor. I thank you. But five, thank you for allowing me to speak today. My mission and my ancestors. 